Hello, um, everybody, this is Cat Mario, and welcome to Final Nights of the Krusty Krab. I know there hasn't been a Cat Mario Plays in a while, the last time I did it was like January, but I wanted to make up for that by playing this. Final Nights of the Krusty Krab. Uh, I tried recording this before, but the graphics on all turned up, but I gave the game a little too much to handle. This time I'm just going with me. So, let's just. Uh, uh, what is going on? Come on! Is this really gonna happen? Is it really gonna. Okay, yeah, there we go. There we go, that's what I wanted. Okay, where's my office? Okay, there we go. Uh, hello? Uh, hello, hello? Oh, oh hey! Welcome to your new job at the brand new Krusty Krab restaurant. Uh, so I'm the manager of this store, and I've been giving a list of instructions to help you get settled into your new and exciting career with us. We're very glad to have you on board here. So, uh, first off, welcome to the new Krusty Krab. Uh, you may be familiar with some of the older restaurants in the chain, notably the original store as well as the Krusty Krab too. Uh, but this is a brand new store, and as you can tell, in a brand new location. Uh, as you already know, I am the manager here, uh, appointed by Mr. Kraft himself, to be honest. Uh, and I have selected you as the night watchman here. That means it's your job to watch over the place as well as the other employees for me. Uh, oh yeah. As you're probably letting you know, uh, instead of hiring a brand new crew, uh, Mr. Kraft simply staffed the kitchen here with animatronic replicas of his old employees and neighbors. Kraft isn't known to be the most trusting person, especially with his money and secret recipe. So, so, I guess I it does make a bit of sense. Anyway, speaking of valuables, they're located in the safe behind you, so it's your job to lock down the office in case you see any intruders. You can do this by closing the glass doors on either side of the room. Just bear in mind that at night, we switch over to a backup generator with a limited supply of power. Closing those glass doors, as well as using any other electrical equipment, will increase the strength of the generator. If you use too much, the restaurant will go dark and you'll be completely vulnerable. Uh, one last thing, if you notice any electrical equipment acting up, like uh, lights flickering or something, uh, the most likely cause is the animatronics. Uh, they've been designed to draw power from an outside source to save on their own energy costs. So if you notice the office lights flashing, then it probably just means they want to run the landing up in front of you. I wouldn't worry too much about it. Anyway, that's enough for me. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good luck and have a good night. Okay, so this is what I don't like. Okay, at least I could use ALTGR. Because you see the control on this side of the keypad? You can't use that to use the flashlight. You need to use the one at the left side of the keypad. Which I really find annoying, considering I am right handed. Did they even think of that? The developer even thought it would depend. I heard some music. What's the music? Does that mean someone's moving? Let's check. Let's check the lights. There. No. So this is laggy a little bit, but I don't. I don't worry about it. and 98% power. Huh? The power does go down slow. Oh, Patrick's moving. Patrick's moving a little bit. So where is he gonna come from? Let's see if anyone else is moving. So I guess Patrick's gonna come from this side. I'm guessing, I'm guessing Patrick's gonna come from that side. So if I, so if he gets too close, I need to do that. Like five nights of parties. Three a.m. I really love SpongeBob. 
I'm a massive fan of it. I've even got, I've even got one of the movies. I don't have both the movies because I, I don't know. I just I, the only reason, the only reason I haven't got the first, the original SpongeBob movie, um, is because I haven't been able to find it in stores. So we need to get to the um, to 6 a.m. for night one to be over. So let's go. There's Mr. Krabs there. He doesn't seem to be moving. Gone. Patrick is gone. Patrick is gone. Where is Patrick? Where the hell is Patrick? Okay, check. Check here. Just check the cameras. Oh, SpongeBob looks like he's moving as well. SpongeBob's moving. Oh no! What just happened? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, oh god. Bleh. Stop with the music! Okay, okay, okay. Jump! I don't like this. I don't like this. Okay, Patrick's fine. Oh my god. Oh god, but where's SpongeBob? Where's SpongeBob gonna come from? Oh, oh no! I don't know where SpongeBob's gonna go. Ah! What the hell was that? Just to make sure there's no one sneaking around back there. If someone got in, they could do all kinds of nasty stuff to your equipment. Lights could go haywire, doors cease to function. It would not be pretty at all. Oh, one last thing. Don't ask how, but we discovered something rather interesting about the animatronics today. Uh, sometimes they start behaving oddly, and we we'll even simply stare in the face. What the hell just happened? Trish, you have a flashlight with you? Anyway, I gotta get going. I think he said something about 
why I have the flashlight. Oh no, I should have been listening. Okay, so I gotta keep an eye on this room, okay? Cause that, okay, that was the, okay, that, the, 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 and then that was my why my lights were flickering. Okay, put the camera down. Okay, put it down. So I think this night we're gonna see Sandy and or Squidward. Right. So I think I think this night we're gonna see Sandy and or Squidward. Mr. Krabs, he still hasn't moved. Put that camera down. Why can I not put the camera down? Let me stop that. Okay. Right. Cut control. Put on bunch of lights. We had a close call last time. All the activity really started at like 3 a.m. I'm guessing this time it's gonna start at 2 a.m. And we're at 2 a.m. Wait, nothing's really going on except the creepy music playing. Then again, it's only night two at 2 a.m. Oh god! Right when I freaking said it! Oh damn! Sandy! Right when I freaking said it! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! No! Oh god! Oh oh god! Oh no! Oh no! What am I supposed to do now? Oh, the SpongeBob! Eh, Sandy! Eh, Sandy cheats, please! Don't do anything to me. Oh, God, Sandy's got this! No, no! These Squidward's gone too! Everything is trying to kill me! Okay. Okay, you're, you're, you're gone? Oh, wait, I see some. I think I see some. Yeah, my mind's probably just playing in there, don't Oh my god. I got to, I got to in. No. Four a.m. is what I got to. No, God. 
God damn it. Ugh. <sighs> 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 Oh my god, no! What? Oh, oh, oh god. Oh, 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 oh. What? Okay. Oh my god, I can't believe that happened. The game freaking crashed. Oh, actually, here's something I want to do. I want to see what happens when you run out of power. That'll be fun. I want to see what happens when you run out of power. It's gonna, it's gonna be fun. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be fun. Let's see what happens when you run out of power. Run out of power. So, so go to my graphics settings. Just make sure it's on medium. Okay, I think we're good. So now we're gonna go with this. Night, continue night two. And then we're just gonna close all the doors and turn all the lights and see what I And just use the camera. Okay, let's, okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's see what happens. And there's no phone call for some weird reason. There's no phone call this time. So guys, this is what I'm going to do. I want to see a jump scare in this game. So I'm just going to close all the doors. Every single door, including the one in the camera. Okay. That's good. Got me you can rewind twice like Steve the Ultimate Challenge. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can definitely got me. I mean, do you even know that this year has been the best year for my channel? Okay, not been the best year for me, but the best year for my channel. Because I'm getting 400 subscribers in this year. Almost 500 subscribers in this one year. Yeah, that's enough to get you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, Maybe you need like 5,000, 10, I don't know. Maybe you need like 10,000 or 100,000. 100,000? Okay. Okay, me. Stop. Please. 
Yeah, let me say what I was gonna say. So, I think you might need like uh, 50,000 in order to be on one of them because, like, 50,000 to have you to do the job. Because YouTubers like PewDiePie, Markiplier, Dr. Guy, and Black Panther, they consider um, their YouTube a job. Well, that's because they, they can actually use it as a job. Um, so, okay, you know what? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think this is going to work. This is just not going to work. It's just it, the it, the power is gonna go down too slow, so we'll need to just react to the dog here. Let's just let's just uh, watch a video of a jump scare. Everything all jumps. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see some of the. We'll see one of these jump scares. So let's see. Let's see this. Oh, my God. 